name is tiffany wood. i'm a certified anusara yoga teacher i live in park city, utah and today we're going to do a pose called vasisthasana it's one of my favorite poses it's um a arm balance it's a back bend it's a forward fold and it's just super fun all the way around it's uh, got a lot to offer and there's lots of poses that lead up to this uh, final expression of vasisthasana so I'll show you the very first expression or the deepest expression and then I'll break it down for you. So here we go. So to get into Vashisthasana, you'll take uh, hands and knees so that you can find nice, strong, steady arms and a sweet, soft heart. Maintaining that, lift up to dog pose. Take a couple breaths. Turning into one of the poses that leads up to this, side plank. And as you take side plank, be mindful that the creases of your elbows turn in the same direction as the crown of your head so that your shoulder blades can come into your heart. I like to bend my bottom leg and root into that foot. And with the bottom leg bent, you can then access the strong, straight hamstring of the lifted leg. And from everything pulling into the core of your pelvis, extend from your pelvis, root through the bottom leg, turn into the strength and light of your heart, and expand, opening. Vashisthasana. So obviously in order to do that pose, we'll need to open up quadriceps, open up our hamstrings, and find a steady strength in our arms. One of my favorite poses that you could use as a bus stop, a place to learn how to do Vashisthasana is gatekeeper's pose, and it's turning sideways, one leg bent, one leg straight. And again, the crease of the elbow faces the crown of your head. Extend from your hips through your legs and open your heart very similar expression. That's one pulse. Mm. One of my favorite prep poses for Vashisthasana, that's a variation of Vashisthasana, looks like this. One foot steps halfway up, both feet turn in the direction of your heart, shoulder blades on your back, Squeeze your legs to midline, and then from your hips, make a beautiful offering. Strong feet, strong hands. I like this pose because it opens up the hips and gives you that awareness of how to pull into the pelvis to expand out from the pelvis. Mm. Good old standby is turn both feet, the knife edge of your bottom foot, squeeze your thighs to midline. From your hips, extend through your legs, curl your shoulder blades into your heart, and lift up into side plank. So there's three variations that lead you to Vashisthasana. 